Good morning, everyone. It is Lisa from Lisa Grateful Me, and it's a fabulous Wednesday. It's gorgeous outside. The sun is just shining. And my hubby and I started our day off by sitting underneath our tree, having our breakfast, and just enjoying the world in which we live. So, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I hope that you stick around and that you want to subscribe and become part of the Lisa Grateful Me team. Well, lots of things are happening, some fun things I want to show you, and we will be doing our larger savings challenges today. But before I get too far into my video, I just wanted to remind everyone about these beautiful roses from Rose Forever. And um, if you go over to their website and put in this coupon code, Lisa Grateful Me 25, you will get $25 off your order. And I just love that they are allowing all my subscribers that may be interested in giving out roses that last an entire year, you know, a perk and getting $25 off their order. So thank you so much for letting me be part of um, showing your beautiful product. And I just wanted to leave that with you guys because on my last video, I gave some of these, I opened a new box and there were roses in there that I gave to my mother. So wonderful for Mother's Day for, you know, just that special person in your life that you want to give a gift to that keeps on giving. Okay, I'm going to slide these roses just back a hair so we can see them and we are going to get into our video. I'm gonna count this money here. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, oh my goodness, 27, 28, 29. So not a bad amount of money for our savings challenges today. Also, I had the, a subscriber, Janelle, um, I'm not sure how to say your last name, but um, Janelle sent me this beautiful uh, savings challenge. She created it. She's just a subscriber. She doesn't have a YouTube channel or an Etsy shop, but how, you know, it is so cute. I encourage you to open an Etsy shop because this is adorable. This is an envelope savings challenge. The numbers go 5, 10, 15, 20, all the way up to 50 for each row. And you save 1,375. And it's Squirrel Away Savings Envelope Challenge. Janelle, this is adorable. I appreciate it. And I'm going to add it to the mix. I also was going to show you guys, I purchased this over at from Donna Powered by Creativity. It is so stinking cute. It's Eeyore and flowers. Just remind me of summer and spring. And this one is going to be added to the mix. Now this whole entire binder is full of challenges. And you guys all know that I create my own as well. So when I get new challenges, I just go ahead, I put them in the back, and then I eventually get to them because I have a lifetime to save money and a lifetime to do challenges. We're going to, oh my, you know what? I need, never mind. I was gonna grab my envelopes to put all this in because I forgot to, but I'm just gonna put the money on top of each challenge and then I'll go back and place them in the envelopes later. Okay, we were going to start with our Santa's Little Helper. Each of these, we have, um, three of these Saving Santa Little Helpers. And um, each one is for a member of my family. So this one's for my husband. We are saving a dollar a week until Black Friday. And then we are going to go ahead and give our money away to someone or purchase things for someone that is in need. And so... Um, I really love this idea. It was actually my mom's idea. And so I can't take credit for it. I just made the challenge. And we would love everyone to participate. And it is a freebie on our on my channel. So you can find it in the description. All right. So there's a dollar for that one. I'm going to put this aside. And this one is mine. 
Another dollar. And now let's do this one. And this one is for my son, Caleb. So we're really excited about giving out a little bit of help and a little bit of love during the Christmas holiday. Okay, I already finished my L buck challenge. Now, here's my Road to 10K challenge. This was created by Veronica over at 40 Plus Life. You could just, if you know Veronica, you love her. She's just got the best personality and she's so bubbly. And she's teaching us Japanese as we listen to her channel. So I'm happy to say that I've gained 50 new subscribers. And for every 50, I put in $5. So that is what we'll do. And you guys, I can't wait to watch my channel grow. Um, you know, in the beginning, I was a lady who didn't even know anything about YouTube. I didn't know anything about running computers, basically. And I just smile because now I have a YouTube channel and I just feel like I've made some progress because I just took a leap. So if you're thinking about it, just take a leap. Do it. All right, on to our telephone challenge. This is so fun. I really like this idea. I created this with, oh, I have a little helper. It's my sweet little granddaughter. I created this um, challenge kind of just to do something new. So each line here is a phone number of someone I love or like our family's old home landline or my husband's old home landline or my grandma's, this is the very first one's my grandma and she passed away. But uh, I just, you know, I just remember picking up the phone and calling her and asking her for a recipe or asking her for help or asking her how her day's going. Um, my grandma was, super, come here, sweetheart. My grandma was super sassy 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 lady and she would always make me smile okay we're gonna color in let's see i think we're just gonna do 20 today for this so we'll make all the numbers equal 20 so there's a seven and now grandma's phone number is all filled in oh uh, let's see let's do three here that will make 10 and let's see, we need to do 10 more. We can do two fives. Yeah, let's do that. We'll do this five. Here you go. Can you hold this for me? Okay. This five. And we can do this five. So just a kind of cute, fun way to save some money. This is available on our Etsy shop at the Happy Mailbox Co. And I did pull the envelope, had got the envelope out and the envelope's the cutest thing about this challenge. Okay, moving on to retirement. Retirement is going to get $20. And let's color in this one right here. Retirement is really moving along. Um, my goal every year is to save is to do a savings challenge for retirement one that's over a thousand dollars and just add to um mine and my husband's retirement fund you know little by little okay i've been waiting for this the sloth savings challenge i'm going to roll you guys last time i rolled the dice that had i think someone said it was a percentage dice or something i know nothing about these dice but um i rolled it and i hit 50 bucks and I was thinking I was rolling the the one that does up to 20 because that's the soft challenge, one to 20. So let's roll and see how much money we are adding into it today. Okay, well, we're adding $4. That is pretty easy and pretty doable. Um, this is just a fun way to do this challenge. I was using this challenge to get out of debt, but since I've paid off my consumer debt, my husband and I had one credit card and it was pretty big. It was like $10,000. We had to do it for some different reasons, but since I paid it off now, this challenge, I'm going to go at a sloth pace and I'm just going to add to it. And then every month, 
the amount of money that I save, I'm going to put down on my mortgage to help pay that down. To, and I just really love that idea. So no stress. So right now, okay, Miss Muffet, <laughs> Grandma's got to do my challenge. Yes, I got to do this. Okay, this is like life with grandkids. So, you know what? I'm going to count this later. I'm just going to put this in here, and we are going to move along. My little helper is wanting to just start coloring. This cute challenge is by oh. Tracy Monster. She is one of my good friends on YouTube. Her and I have done a collab before, and I just wanted to show her some love by doing her savings challenge. And this is our Hawaii challenge. Um, this is a game that you can play, and I know all of many of you like to play games on YouTube and you know, with your savings challenges. I like to do every square because I like to maximize everything. So let's just count up some money here. There's five, six, my small icons are two, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Let's go to here. Let's do $13. Hopefully I have enough ones. Okay. I'm just going to do 15 because I don't have enough ones out right now. And let's cross these out. Five, six, seven, eight, and five more is 13. So if you love this, this is going for my vacation fund. I mean, how could it not? It's a Hawaii savings, and I absolutely love it. So adorable. Spring. Okay, this is one that we have to put a lot of money in because, hello, spring's like over. So there's 10, 20, 30, 40. $40 to color up these two rows. Oh, thank you, Grandpa. And then 5, 10, 15, 20. Do I have another 20? 5, 10, 15, 20. 1, 2. Okay, I need two more dollars to finish this challenge if I put all this money in here. Is that what I want to do? Maybe not. Maybe it, this challenge is going to go past spring. And we'll just keep at it. At it. Okay, so here we go. We're going to add 20 this time, and then I think we will add the rest of the money next time and complete it. Oh, let's see if I can find some colored pencils that kind of match this. So I'm just going to go like this, and then I'll go back and color it in. So there's... Let's see, 12. Kanoa. Oh, this is like a train wreck today. I mean, with my dog and my granddaughter. <laughs> okay, 18. And we're going to do a two over here. And that will equal $20. So there we go for our spring challenge. Adding $20. Okay, no. I'm happy to say that my dog, remember I told you guys he, got, he was bit? Just a minute, let me put this up. Okay, now he can't see out the window, so hopefully he'll quit. He was bit by another dog, and for about, ooh, many, many days, he was not walking on it, and we had to just do a lot of cleaning of it and taking care of him, but he is fine now, and he is back to his old self. Okay, let's add to the turtle challenge. We have the turtle, and we have Snow White left. Oh... Let's see, did I put the $20 over here for this spring challenge? I did. Okay, let's do 10 for our turtle. I'll do that and grab. I don't think this is the right color that matches, but it's okay. We're gonna fill it in. So there's five. And five more will make 10. Isn't this adorable challenge? I love it. It's really a low dollar amount, so it fits any budget. And it is just the cutest thing. Um, it's great for all those animal lovers. 
And, you know, our family, we have a special place in our hearts for turtles after our trip to Hawaii. We were able to see them and be with them and observe them. And it was so amazing. My grandkids still, turtles are their favorite. Okay, moving along, let's do... Let's do $12 to Snow White. We're gonna do that. So 10, 11, 12. And let's color in some apples. This is so cute. You know, um, let's see, let's do two fives and two ones. This just reminds me of childhood and it's so youthful and just, just fun. So there's five and I think I have maybe just a couple more fives left and then all the high numbers are filled in so this is another challenge that has low amounts and you can get this over at donna powered by creativity so there we go color this in and i have one more to color in just darling. And this challenge, when you're done, you will have saved $100. So the, the philosophy of little by little really adds up is very so true in this case. Okay, here is my challenge from Kayla over at KTW Planning and Designs. No, KTW Planning and Budgeting. Kayla, I'm just making up your, I'm making a new channel name for you. What the heck? <laughs> Seriously, sometimes. All right, this is for July. My birthday's in July, and this challenge is for me to do fun birthday things. And I'm going to do the Buck Moon, both of those. So two tens make a 20, and here's our $20 for that. And we'll color this in. This is super fun. So I'm gonna color just these little squares in, but I can't wait to go back. I love to color. I'm gonna pull out my markers. Once this challenge, I've completed it and color it all in and just have it be so pretty. So if you're wanting um, a birthday challenge, you can head over to Kayla's channel and you can head on over to her Etsy shop and go ahead and get this challenge. Now, Everyone, I want to show you something. It turned out so stinking cute. It's one of the things that's going up in our shop. And um, in the Lisa Grateful Me Shopify store, this, look how sparkly and cute and how well it matches this alligator on his scooter. I mean, who cannot love this? So it's numbers one to six. All the challenges are like that. It's super easy. It, like I said, this can fit any budget. It can be good for kids and teens and for adults. I personally will be doing this binder myself. Um, I love it. And everything's laminated, so this is something that you could reuse over and over again. You can use dry erase or a Sharpie marker. Sharpies are a little harder to get off. You can use like a magic eraser, but the dry erase will just wipe right off. So there is the alligator on his scooter challenge. And here is this really cute envelope. And then look at this moose. He is driving a truck so cute and I love the forest tree envelope that goes with it now one thing about these books so I am going to make them and put them up on <clears throat> the store excuse me my voice is going cuckoo but I you know I only have a very limited edition there's like 10 of them and that's because the paper that I used to make the envelopes, I can't find it again. But I was thinking that I could keep looking for different papers and if there's somebody who really wanted one of these and didn't get it, you could message me and I could find some other paper and see if I can make some more. In fact, let me tell you a minute about Shopify. Shop of, my Shopify store, I don't know if I'm going to keep going with it. Um, I'm going to use it for the rest of this next month, 
all through June. And then after that, I may just be making products and just saying here on my YouTube channel, hey, I made these. I have like 15 of them. If you're interested, go ahead and um, send me a message at Lisa Grateful Me. I might be doing it that way. So I'm still toying with the idea. I'm trying to see if it's worth it for me. But anyways, here we go. Alligator, super cute moose. Love him. And look at these animals on the bus. I mean, is that just the party bus or what? <laughs> so cute. So there's that one. And then this giraffe on his scooter. I mean, who is not in love with this? And then this elephant with her bike pulling her flowers. Just so stinking cute. And then the monkeys on their bike. Just love it. So these are going to come in. Now, I love this. And hopefully I have another one here. They're going to come in either a bright yellow or a bright green. And I just thought, oh, how fun, 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 fun. Well, everyone, thank you for spending some time with me. I so appreciate you. And today I have to tell you, I'm grateful for my family. I'm grateful for you, my subscribers. And I am grateful for the beautiful world in which I live. We will see you on Friday when we do our sinking funds and our yearly savings challenges. And until then, friends, have the most loveliest of day. Bye.